welcome. Harry Hansen sent me this jacket for the testing as part of the demo team. Uh, a couple of remarks. First of all, very, very red. <laughs> the jacket is really red. It was the first thing that came to mind when I saw it. Second thing is the fabric. Which is something I really like. Fabric is really thin. No mesh in the inside, so it won't stay wet for too long. And it's really thin and light. This really surprised me. This also makes it possible to fold really small, as I will show you later. The only thing is that the hood with the capuchon, I'm not sure, with the cap, the hood with the cap. It's actually quite heavy in comparison to the rest of the jacket. And you'll see also in the folding that the hood is staying as, as big as the rest of the jacket. I would really have liked to see a possibility to take off the hood. As for inshore racing, it's not always necessary to have it. As a helm or a trimmer it's quite nice, but as a bowman or a mast or anything else closer on the front deck, it's not really necessary to have one during the insure racing, as it is an insure race jacket. So the future, it has two lined pockets, which is nice in case you have warm hands, in case you have cold hands, sorry. The only thing is you're, it's quite difficult to access them with a life jacket which I will come back later to, as the collar is also really tight when you're wearing a life jacket. When you wear it normally without a life jacket, it's quite nice, it fits nice around your neck. It also features an inside pocket in case you, you see the necessity to bring your phone or any other valuables on the water. Normally I don't see it, but some people like to do that. Another really nice feature is the inside collars, which keep your waterproof in case you're walking the lines. Same on the other side. 